In this video, you will learn how to use trim and lock surface features. At the beginning, create an order as usual. Choose the type of indication and go to the scan page. Do the scanning process as you normally do. In our example, we will focus on a quadrant. The lock feature gives an option to freeze the surface at a given state. For example, by locking it immediately after the margin line is captured. To access the feature, open the Tools menu. This feature gives you a toolbar where you can select a brush size and simply lock an area by painting it directly on the model. You can also select Preparations, which locks a diameter around the marked tooth. It might be easier to see the locked area if you switch off the color in the menu to the right. When the selected area is OK, click Done. Now start scanning the rest of the jaw. The locked area will not be updated by further scanning. Now to the Trim tool. Trim is used to remove areas that you don't wish to have in your scan. We recommend to trim larger soft tissue areas, tongue and fingers away completely. You can also use Trim to edit your preparation. In case you wish to slightly change the margin or the height of the preparation, just trim it away. If you trim a locked area, the area is no longer locked and you will need rescanning. You can use brush with different thickness options. 1 mm, 2 mm, 4 mm, 4 mm, or patch to remove a free-hanging island by clicking on it. You also have the All Patches tool, which automatically removes all elements that have slim or no attachment to the main surface. To cancel, restore the last action, choose Undo or Redo options. To close the trimming tool without any changes, choose Cancel. If you are satisfied with the trimming and want to accept all the changes, choose Done. Now you have learned how to use the trim and lock surface features. Thank you for watching.